what's up aries sun moon venus rising north and old aries what's going on with you guys i hope all is well with y'all we about to get into a message for you aries this is a general reading meaning that everything may not resonate with you take the parts that resonate with you aries and leave the rest for somebody else out there okay if you would like to book a personal reading feel free to reach out to me via instagram or you can email me all right Aries, let's see what's going on with y'all today. Let's see what's going on. Whenever you come across this message is when it may resonate with you. Time is fluid. There's no gender in tarot, so flip and bounce the rules as you see fit. Masculine, feminine, however you identify as. If it applies, it's for you. All right. Father God, Spirit, angels, ancestors, order, protect and guide me of the highest white light. I call out to you during this time. I ask that you step in, provide me with clear and accurate messages for the zodiac sign of Aries. I also ask that you cover, shield, protect, and bless my energy as I channel these messages for Aries. Cover, shield, protect, and bless those viewers that are watching for their highest good as well. Any evil eye, any negative energy sent my way, any negative projection sent my way or towards my viewers shall be returned to its rightful owner. No weapons formed against us will ever prosper. All evil eyes shall go blind. I say, amen. Aries, what's going on, babes? Let's see. Sun, moon, Venus, rising in North Pole. Aries, my sweet peas. What's going on with you guys? Shout out to the Aries gang out there. Aries, I love you. Let's see what's going on with y'all. What's going on, my Aries? Okay, I see the chariot and the six of swords, Aries. Okay, we got the chariot and the six of swords. So some of y'all could be traveling, okay? You could be on the go, on the move. All right, Aries, go ahead with your bad self. Safe travels, okay? I'm wishing you the best on all your new endeavors. Wherever you're going, baby, I'm wishing you the best. Sending you positive energy, positive vibes. Let's see, Aries. I feel like you're ready for something new, a new adventure. Some of you could be creating something new as well, a new business project, okay? But everything working out in your favor, trust in divine time and Aries will of fortune. I'm hearing that you can't fuck this up. You can't fuck it up. You can't. It's impossible for you to. So, ooh, whatever, whatever you doing, wherever you going, whatever's next for you, this next cycle, this next chapter, it's like it's impossible for you to sabotage it. Like, God is walking with you. The Most High is holding your hand. Okay, trust in the trust in divine timing, right? Will of fortune. I feel like there's a lot of great things that's in store for you. Somebody's upset about that. Okay, temperance in the reverse. Somebody's really angry, really upset about that. Okay, somebody here could have been really working hard to go up against you. For some of you, this person could be a Sagittarius. Don't have to be, but we got strong Sag here. For some of you, this could be a family member. This could even be somebody that you shared a home with. Others of you, this could be somebody that you had children with. Okay, but somebody here is really fucking pissed off, man. Okay, somebody here is mad. And whoever this is, they're very false. Okay, I feel like this person is a liar. Or they could have lied on you. They could have slandered your name. I'm also getting Leo energy. Some of y'all dealing with a Leo or a Sag that can't be trusted. Whoever this is, they're mad because you're healing. You are showing up as the star, Aries. You are the star. I'm hearing that you are loving yourself. You are healing yourself. You are investing in yourself. You are speaking love and life into yourself. You are pouring into yourself. And you are protected by the most high. Didn't I tell you you can't screw this up? Because you're walking by faith, not by sight. And you're walking with the most high. God lives within you and the angels surround you at all times, Aries. This is very powerful, beautiful energy that I'm picking up for you guys. Wherever you headed is good. It's your destined path. It's safe. The road is clear. You're good. You're good, baby. Your angels is making sure that you get to your next destination safely. Yeah, the chariot. Your angels is making sure that your ass gets to your next destination safely, my babies. Okay, the chariot. I told y'all when I cut the deck, before I even started shuffling, right? During the pre-shuffle, I cut the deck. I had the chariot and the six of swords. The chariot came back out. You moving on up, okay? You moving on up, okay? Bigger and better things, okay? Like, you are moving on up. You are soaring. You are reaching new levels, new heights, Aries. Yes, there's a queen of cups in the reverse that's very codependent, that's very upset. For some of you, this could be a mother figure. This could be a family member. This could be um, your own child. This could be a father figure. This could be someone in your family. I'm telling you, take it as it resonates. I got strong Leo. I got Sagittarius. I got Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Somebody here is really upset. 
Somebody here is upset. Where are you going, Aries? Okay, where are you going? We need you, Aries. We need you. You can't leave. You can't leave. You got to stay, Aries. Okay? Somebody here is also doing spell work on y'all. We got the magician in the reverse to the moon. Somebody here could be waiting for every moon cycle, okay? Somebody here is working around the clock. Every moon cycle, somebody here is doing some shit to keep you stuck. Somebody here is planting some seeds to keep you stuck. Somebody here also wants to cause illusions for you, wants you to be worried, wants you to be stressed out, wants you not to invest in yourself, wants you to fear the unknown, wants you to fear taking a leap of faith, investing in yourself, moving forward. Somebody here may know that you want to move forward or travel or go somewhere or start something new, uh, some sort of new creative idea you have. Whatever it is, it's like somebody here wants you to be up in your head and be scared to go on this new journey, to take this new path, to go down this new road. No, Aries, you protect it. You safe, okay? Don't fall for the bullshit. Don't fall for the okie doke. Don't fall for the illusions. Yeah, okay? Somebody here also wants to come back towards you and possibly talk to you, okay? This is a distraction, okay? This ain't nothing but the damn devil here. Somebody here wants to come in and distract you. Clarify this eight of cups in reverse. Somebody here wants to delay your growth. I'm hearing somebody here wants to stunt your growth. They want to delay your progress. Okay, they want to stop you, block you. Yeah, somebody wants to come in towards you because you are the empress. Come on, Aries, you a whole empress out here. The empress done came out. You the empress, you the emperor, okay? You're healing, you're mastering yourself. The empress and the star. And somebody here is watching you in all your glory and all your power. They like, God damn, man, Aries is doing it, man. Aries is on point, man. Aries is going places. Whoever this is, they feel stuck. They feel blocked. They feel trapped. This person is sad. They could have betrayed you. And now somehow, some way, the tables have turned. Things have shifted. Yeah. Now this person is just waiting to see what your next move is, what you're doing. Aries, move in silence. I'm hearing move in silence. And if something is not off the ground yet, but you're working on it behind the scenes, keep that shit behind the scenes. Don't, um... Don't give anybody any information or anything that you're working on. You don't want any outside interference or, or any negative energy being projected towards any creative ideas you have, okay? But we have the Knight of Cups here to the Hierophant. Clarify this Knight of Cups here to the Hierophant for my Aries. King of Swords in the reverse. King of Wands in the reverse. Mm -mm. This is a hell no. Somebody here that was a player from your past that put you in a third party. This person is not fully disconnected from other people. This pe this person can have multiple people connected to them. This person is coming towards you with a lot of baggage, a lot of drama here. It's a hell no. This person is a player, okay? They're a player. They go cold. They're very, they very detached, okay? This is somebody that could be very heartless. They make ghost people. Like, this is somebody that y'all don't need to be pairing up with. Whoever this is, they want to come towards you. For some of you, it's a fellow fire sign. For others of you, this person could be an air sign or a Taurus. But I don't care. The person sign is whoever they, whoever they are, they don't love you. Okay? They don't love you, Aries. They haven't loved you in the past. They showed you how cold, how callous, how mean, how cruel they can be. This is somebody that really showed you how much of an asshole that they can truly be. This person could be a fire sign, an air sign, or a water sign. But this person is in, embodying all the kings and they all in the reverse. We got the king of wands reverse, the king of swords reverse, and the fucking king of cups reverse. And then we got the devil. This is somebody that's very toxic. And whoever this is, they're viewing you as a possession. Aries, you belong to me. Okay? I'm not done with you. We're not done until I say it's over. You're not getting away from me. You're not going too far. Okay? That's how this person is. They want to have like a hold on you. Even if y'all are not actually physically together, this person feels like they should have some sort of hold on you energetically. This person feels like you're going towards your wish fulfillment, like there's a lot of abundance attached to you, okay? And they they like, nah, Aries, I'm, I got to be with you. I got to be a part of this. I know you got good things coming towards you. I have to be a part of this. This is somebody that don't give a damn about you. They don't. Aries, I just got to keep it real. You know what I'm saying? I hope that y'all don't think this message is coming out too harsh. I know that y'all don't. Aries, you real as fuck. You very blunt yourself. Shit, I'm an Aries rising, so I already know how we give it up. Aries, I could be real with you. This person don't give a fuck about you. They don't. King of Wands reverse, King of Swords reverse, King of Cups reverse, and the devil. No. This is somebody that just sees this. This is somebody that, first of all, they not dealing with nobody unless they feel like it's something really good in it for them. This person don't want to deal with nobody unless they got money. They don't want to deal with nobody unless they feel like they're going to have money. Like, this person got to feel like you about to be set up for success 
or you are going to provide them with some sort of abundance, some sort of success. That's the only reason why they're going to pair up with you. I don't really feel like this person ever truly loved you. But with the justice part here, they feel like you're getting some sort of justice. you getting your wish fulfillment. you getting blessings on blessings. Aries, you're showing up as the empress and the high priestess. You're very powerful in the justice card here. Some of you can have Pisces, Virgo, or Libra in your chart. But you're showing up as somebody that is really getting everything that's owed to you. And this person wants to come in quickly and like distract you and come in quickly and make you feel like you two have unfinished business. This person is not investing in you whatsoever. There's no true investment here. There's no real love connected to this. This is somebody that just wants to latch on, okay? They just want to latch on. This person is showing up as someone that's codependent. This person is showing up as someone that will drain you, someone that will use you. This is somebody that wants to come in and give you a love offer. They want you to be blinded to the truth. They want you to be blinded to the fact that they're still a third party. They want you to be blinded to the fact that they will always continuously put you in a third party. Aries, no. Okay, the tower is here. Absolutely not. Your spirit guides are urging you to move forward and to avoid this person at all costs. This is not somebody that y'all need to let back in. This is somebody wanting to spin a block. Eight of Cups in the reverse. And this is not somebody that y'all need to let back in. Yes, ignore this person. Ignore them. Turn your back on them. This person still has a third party. And they will continue to have a third party. This is not somebody that's coming in to truly invest in you. Aries, for a lot of you, I'm proud because it's saying that you don't feel the same for this person. You don't want this person. You wanted them before, but you don't want them anymore. I feel like when you wanted this person, this person gave you your, their ass to kiss. Now that this person feel like you went in in some sort of way, they want to come towards you. No. Aries, no. Okay? This is your quick message for today, but this is a no. This is this is the message. It's a no. And I feel like a lot of y'all already like, yo, I already know. You got the tower in a hermit. A lot of y'all like, yo, this is just my confirmation. I already know, sis. I ain't fucking with it. Yeah, Aries, don't fuck with this. This is a this is a no-no. This is a real no-no here. Okay. This is somebody that will continue to put you in third parties. They could be a fellow fire sign, an earth sign, a water sign, or an Aquarius, whoever this is, man. It's a no. 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 All right, confirmation by that loud bang. It's a no. It's a hell no. It's a hell no. It's a hell to the no, no, no. A hell to the no, to the no, no, no. Hell to the no. <laughs> I might title that this, okay? Because it's a hell to the no, no, no. Hell to the no. To the no, 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 hell to the no. <laughs> Yo, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm having too much fun over here, but I'm telling you, it's a hell to the no for real. It's a hell no, no, no. <laughs> All right, Aries, I'm going to talk to y'all soon. Have a great day, Aries. I love y'all. Peace.